symphony can only mean one thing. It is time for Seth freaking Rollins. Listen to the WWE Universe. They're singing along, and they're not done yet. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Davenport, Iowa. Seth Rollins is one of the elite superstars in WWE, and the list of competitors he's put down reads like a who's who of future Hall of Famers. If we know one thing about the visionary, it's that he's always down for some action. Rollins doesn't take a back seat to anyone. Rollins enters the ring like a principal conductor about to lead an orchestra. And just like he controls this crowd, Rollins knows exactly what he's doing and can play his opponents like a finely tuned instrument. Just look at this specimen, carved from marble. He's not a Greek god, he's a Scottish god. Drew McIntyre in peak physical condition. He is focused and he is ready for a fight. And there is no telling what he might do here tonight. The Scottish warrior has earned every bit of respect he is given. He is transformed from the chosen one to a real life fire breathing dragon. Yeah, the WWE is the Scottish warrior's battleground and he will go face to face with absolutely anyone. Seth Rollins picked this fight with Drew McIntyre because he believes that it's his calling to be the undisputed face of this industry. But he may have picked a bigger fight than he bargained for. Yeah, McIntyre's response to Seth's claims have been pretty emphatic. Drew thinks Rollins is a deluded megalomaniac, and he is committed to ensuring Seth doesn't get his way. Seth is an ambitious visionary, and Drew just doesn't have the foresight to understand that. So now Rollins feels obligated to usher Drew into a bright new era. Close line. All the way up. Done good. Oh man, right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. He's absorbed some damage already. Yeah, and that can be a building block for McIntyre to build upon. Could do it. Gets the shoulder up in one. Getting that shoulder up seemed to be pretty easy. Split blade by Rollins. When you're taking on a mastermind like Seth Rollins, the most important thing to remember is that you have to take away his ability to control the match. Pace is a good place to start. If Rollins wants things fast, slow them down. If he tries to be methodical, slow! Barrel roll to pain. Took a massive risk, but it might have paid off. Rip Courtney. A relentless continued assault from Rollins. Smart offense from Seth is keeping Drew off balance. Oh, caught him. Uh-oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. Look at it. end this emphatically. What a pedigree. Rollins landing a huge hit on McIntyre, giving Seth an opening here. Goes under the ropes to get back inside. He's stalking his opponent from the top. 
This incredibly shoulders down. It's over. It is over. Here is your winner, Seth Freaking Rollins. And with this win over McIntyre, you have to wonder if Seth was right all along. Maybe Drew really isn't ready to stand atop the mountain here in WWE. For my money, Seth Rollins is still the future of this industry. I don't know, Corey. Seth may have won the day, but Drew still put up a heck of a fight. But in the end, a win's a win for the Messiah. For the moment, Rollins can gloat all he wants, and there's nothing